Christine, thanks so much for joining us and congratulations. Thank you for having me. Well, we'll get to the award in just a minute, but I have to start by asking you about that 30 rebound game you had on Sunday in Pullman. It was, it was fun for me to see all the excitement lighting up my uh, Twitter feed and on social media. What was it like playing through that game? What was going through your mind and who was the coolest person you heard from afterwards? Honestly, like I just played that game like I played every single game. Um, we needed that win, and I knew that if I came with intensity and effort, that we would excel. And never did I imagine that I would have 30 rebounds, but I guess that's what you get when you work hard. <laughs> And Christine, um, I know over the summer you really dedicated yourself to improving defensively, and you yeah. certainly did just that. Is there anybody in particular that really said to you, come on, let, let's get after it a little more? Definitely my best friend, um, Jabari, he went here. and he Jabari just, Bird? Bird, yeah. Oh. Like, that's, like, honestly, like, my best friend, and um, I've dedicated, like, part of my this year to him because of everything that he's went through, and... Um, I don't know, like, he just told me, like, you need to get lower on defense, you need to be able to block shots and be efficient. Um, I worked out with him throughout the whole summer, and he was just always constantly giving me advice and being there for me, had my back through everything. So this year, when I throw and I get the rebounds or when I do these incredible things, I look back to the summertime when my mom, Lindsay, and all these people were just rooting for me and never gave up on me. And you, you talk about Coach Gottlieb a lot and what she's meant to you as a person and as a player. Tell us about how she impacted you on the defensive end. And, and I know Sharman Smith's been part of that as well with her yeah. get every rebound. Yeah, Sharman definitely has been on me um, since my freshman year. Honestly, she believed in me when I really didn't believe in myself and ever, and two years ago I wasn't ever expecting to get defensive player of the year like that was out of reach and um, watching great players like Jordan Canada get low and be efficient on defense made me just want to increase my play um, watching Monique get every single rebound playing against her having that high motor um, I wanted that so I think honestly like my team has supported me Lindsay like everyone knows I love her to death um, and she was just actually like laughing she's like two years ago we would have never thought Christine <laughs> and I was like um, she's like you should be really really proud of yourself and I don't know I expect really good things from our program and just being the first player um, to get this award means a lot to me. Well, certainly are that, all that hard work and extra work paid off for you. The season, I know, was extra special because you had both of your brothers in the Bay Area as well. One is a freshman at San Jose State, and then your older brother is in med school at UCSF. What was it like having them close and being able for them to see you break some of those records you took down this year? My brother, my older brother, actually came to the rec, um, to the game where I um, broke the re, the point scoring record. There's so and, many records; um, it's hard to remember which one. I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> and it was actually really funny because he brought a lot of his classmates, and they were just all like cheering and laughing. And he ended up winning like this competition. Like he threw the ball like like over half court and made it like from the stands and it, it was crazy everyone was like cheering for him and i was looking up i was like what did my brother do why is he just laughing <laughs> and it was just really funny because everyone after the game was like did you see your brother did you see your brother and i was like oh my gosh of course trying to steal your spotlight maybe a little bit all right last thing yeah. and then we'll let you go because i know you've got a flight to catch to vegas you get the washington state Cougs in the first round of the tournament on yeah. thursday so how many rebounds are you going to get in that one I just want to win, honestly. Like, I just want to win. Whatever it takes. <laughs> yeah. All right, Christine, congratulations on being named Pac-12 Defensive Player of the Year. We're so happy for you, and we're looking forward to seeing you and the Cal Bears in Vegas tomorrow. Yeah, thank you so much. Can't wait to see you.